Hi guys, in this video we're going to be using R to make a not notched box plot. So here's a picture of a box plot we just made using this command, box plot. It's a box plot of mortality, which comes from the US Melanoma database. This is just our title, and this is just the color. This is just showing some, some functionality of a box plot. Now, if you want notches, and if you want notches, you probably have heard about this, read about this, or had something in class about this. And you know what they're useful for. I won't go into the statistics of it. But you use the function notch equals true in the box plot function. And this, as you saw right away in the picture to the right, creates the notches here. Now, notches are quite useful when you're doing side-by-side -side box plots and you could see whether the notches of one of the box plots overlaps with the notches of the others. And you could see in this hypothetical example that I made here, these box plots, the, these notches do not cross, do not overlap with these notches. So we can uh, almost surely say that their medians are not equal to each other. If they do overlap, it's it's the opposite. We're, we can't say that their medians aren't equal to each other. So, this is really what I wanted to show you here. The function, which is box plot, using the notched equals true command. Okay? So, be sure to check out my other R videos. I'm going to do a side-by-side -side box plot, and I'm going to use notch notches so that we can actually see this uh, in a real example so be sure to check that out and while, go to my channel subscribe while you're there and click on our sponsors ads that's what keeps these videos coming to you for free until next time have a great day